I'm in Eastern Oregon at the northernmost entrance to Bogus Cave, I think. This one has an entrance at both ends. Uh, I mean, this breakdown entrance has a way in at both ends of the collapse, however you want to say that. I know, so I'm going to do the uh, southernmost one now. You can see in front of you. Unless there's some tumbleweeds in the way. That noise here is grasshoppers. There's a lot of grasshoppers around here. dead end. I know it goes to the middle sink, but there's a choke point that's a uh, belly crawl. I don't want a belly crawl, so I'm going to skip that part. So let's see if I can get down here without slipping. tripping on these tumbleweeds. So let me sit down here a second. Man, my flashlight's being a piece of junk. Darn it. There is the way to the south I was talking to you about. Uh, huh. It's like there's room to go over here too. Let me look under here real quick. It'd be funny if there was a lower level. Yeah, I'm not gonna get through there. Wonder if it would even be possible. Yeah, I don't think I could fit through there if I tried. It's the funny thing about caves. Sometimes the biggest part is hidden beside, find a little tiny cubby hole. But do you really wanna get yourself stuck trying to find all those cubby holes? Anyway, so yeah, up there, that's the way to the middle sink. Like I said, it's a belly crawl. I don't want to bother it. Try. I haven't seen any bats or other wildlife in these caves. Kind of strange, because it's not like there's a lot of shade around here. So you'd think this place would be crawling with animals trying to get out of the sun. But maybe they're all used to the heat. <laughs> there aren't a lot of other caves around here that I know of either. So it's not like the bats are somewhere else. Excuse me. All right, well, there we are, the northern sink to Bogus Cave. 